So this year the Commission is looking at retirement income policies and those are the policies literally that relate to your income in retirement. Now I know this might not sound like a, um, a subject that's going to get the pulse racing but it is a really important one and it's important because we have an ageing population. Today we have around 680,000 New Zealanders who are 65 plus but in about 20 years that would be closer to 1.3 million New Zealanders. So the number of people working relative to the number of people retired will change. In today's system, it's taxpayers today who pay for super uh, for retirees. So a person earning $60,000 today will probably pay about $1,800 a year towards New Zealand super. As the demographics of the population change and we've got fewer people working relative to those retired, then some of those numbers are going to come under pressure. But we're not talking about making changes today. We're talking about what we need to do for tomorrow to keep a retirement income sustainable into the future. Uh, at the moment, uh, super is about 4% of GDP. By mid-century, we anticipate the predictions based on certain assumptions is that it'll be closer to 8% of GDP. Now, while that's clearly doubling where we're at now, we do need to look at the benchmark, the OECD benchmark, where we can see that 4% is very low relative to OECD average, which is about eight, and that by mid-century, we will be reaching the average as it is today. So that's the important point that tells us we've got time. But the phrase I use is we've got time, but not all the time in the world. And I think it's important that our young people today, who are our retirees of tomorrow, uh, understand the change that is ahead. So this year what we'll be doing is we'll be putting a lot of information out uh, to the public via research, via uh, town halls and round tables. Um, we'll also be putting it out via social media channels, via our Facebook. And that's important, but what's even more important is that we will be asking people to tell us what they think. Uh, we're sending a tent around New Zealand and we'll put the program on the website so people can come into the tent and be filmed telling us what they think and don't hold back. Um, and we'll be building other channels for you to let us know your thoughts on this subject. We're going to break the year down into seven themes so that we can deal to this subject, a big subject, in bite-sized chunks. And uh, what you'll see on the website each month is what the theme is for that month, what research we'll be putting out, what facts and figures we'll be putting out, and where we're going to come to somewhere near you. This is a subject that really matters for New Zealand, and we really want to hear from you. We want to know your opinion. You don't have to be retired to tell us what you think. In fact, we really, really want to hear from people who aren't retired yet, we want to hear from younger New Zealanders, because you are the ones who will be affected the most by the changes that are ahead. In another month's time, we'll do another quick video, we'll do another update on what we've done, on what's coming next month, on what we're hearing, and you'll see it all on the website.